what is up everyone today i'm gonna show you how to install a hard drive into your desktop pc so first things first you want to remove the side panel by removing the two thumb screws as you can see right here and go ahead and remove the screws and go ahead remove your side panel as you can see right here we have all our drive base at the front and here you can see that's my current hard drive and there are other five slots open for more hard drives so from this side of the case we cannot access the hard drives so what you want to do is go ahead and remove the other side panel by removing the two thumb screws and just slide off the side panel quick tip is to make sure that you don't lose your thumb screws so here we have access to the hard drive from the other side and this is where I'm gonna be putting my second hard drive go ahead and just pinch those tabs and pull the drive bay out of the case So before you touch any of your new hardware, you want to make sure that you get rid of your static discharge on your body by touching any metal. And there we go, we're all ready. So let's go ahead and open this hard drive. As you can see, it's wrapped in an anti-static bag to make sure it doesn't get any static damage during shipping. And here we go, we have our new hard drive. There we go, Western Digital Blue, three terabyte, 5,400 RPM. And as you can see on the side, these are the mounting holes. This would be where the screws go, but in this case, it's a toolless design, so we don't need screws. We just need to line up these pins, as you can see right here, into the mounting holes of the hard drive. So as you can see, the drive bay is flexible, and that's actually how we're gonna install our hard drive. We just line up the holes to the pins. There we go. one side's in and go ahead and pull on the drive bay because it is flexible and just line up the pins make sure everything's lined up and there we go our hard drive is all ready for going into the case so just double check everything everything lines up and yeah I think we're ready So now we are going to be installing the hard drive into the case. So go ahead and grab your hard drive. Everything's ready. Just double check. Nice. Everything's good. And just line it up to the case. And just push it. And there should be a click. There we go. So that's it. Now it's all now it's in there. So now what we need to do is we need, as you can see with my other hard drive, it's all wired up with SATA and power. And this one is going to be power and SATA for data transfer. So let's go ahead. I'll show you guys the power. This is what I'm going to be using for the power. So I went ahead and plugged everything in except the SATA cable. So as you can see, we have power right there. Same layout as the other hard drive. And now, all we need is the SATA cable for data transfer. So I'm gonna show you guys the SATA cable. And here it is. Let's go ahead, just open it up. 
and here's what it should look like and both ends of the cable should be the same so that's what a SATA cable looks like I'm using a different one in this case but just go ahead plug that in and locate where your SATA ports are in this in my case I have six so you can actually go ahead and choose which one you want to plug it into and just run your wires through the rubber grommets for the case and I let I wired up everything so you can see so yes everything's ready everything's wired up the hard drives are good all the wires are connected power and the SATA cable so now all we need to do is go into Windows and we just need to activate the new hard drive that we installed and that's it so I'm gonna show you guys how to activate the hard drive on my next video so make sure you stick around for that see you guys on the next one